John Wells, not a bad start to his career. You got 40 in, in quick time. Um, any nerves before you started today? Well, definitely. Um, it was. I was very nervous at start. Um, after that first ball hit my butt, it was like a lot of weight was off my shoulder. It felt really good after that. Okay, and um, you got your hat from Great Man Cigar Piece of Business, so that must have um, gave you a special, a special feeling, the greatest cricketer of all time. Definitely, yeah, it was, it was a pleasure indeed um, for me to be receiving my cap from Sir Gary Silvers. And um, you played well, you said after you got your first ball in the back, you, you blossomed really, you played some good shots. What, what, was, what were you thinking, you know, going, going, going in? Well, uh, while, while being out there, uh, Craig was encouraging me to spot my skills and, and play what I see. Um, I played with Craig for a, a, a little while now. It's been a while though, but he was out there supporting me. Okay, and your first boundary when you got that first one to go all the way, what were you thinking? You know, to well, free up a um, bit? to be honest, I, didn't, I, 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 can't, I can't explain the feeling uh, the first ball. I didn't even realize that the ball hit my butt, so it was, it was definitely nerve-wracking for me at, at the beginning. What about the atmosphere of such a, such a big crowd? I mean, most of them are England supporters, but I guess you've never played in front of a crowd of this size. What was, you know, so kind of the atmosphere and feeling, feeling well, test cricket for the first time? It was definitely... I was definitely enjoying it. Uh, scoring a run, I most of our boundary was well received from the crowd. And um, looking at the state of the game now, um, a, a lot of people got starts, but nobody's carried on for big scores. But um, this Hetmar is still in there, and he's and he's playing well. Definitely. Um, we as batsmen, uh, we got some of us got in, and we, in some sense we gave it away. But Hetmar uh, is there still, still, and we have. We have belief in him, so I think it, from tomorrow, I think if we get another 50 runs, that will be good for us. And what do you think with the pitch? Uh, at, the, at the start, you know, it, it wasn't it was a bad at all this evening. It sort of do a bit, help the help new uh, second new ball, help the bowlers a bit. What, what do you make of the pitch overall? It was pretty decent. That's at the start, it was a little bit slow, and then in, in the afternoon, it got better for batting. And you saw the new ball in the, this evening doing a, doing a lot more. So I think it will get it will it will get better as the game goes on. Appreciate it, John, and thanks. Well done. No problem. Uh, Russell, disappointed by the, the late wickets that have changed the scorecard a bit there? Yeah, we would have looked better with four wickets or so, but cricket is cricket. We lost those wickets at the end, so we can't really concentrate on that. Now we just have to just go, go far from here now. I mean, Jimmy Anderson, when he, when he gets the, the thing going, is it so hard? Was it, was it good bowling or was it sloppy batting? How would you rate it? Yeah, well, he's a quality bowler, has 500 odd wickets. I thought he had a, a brilliant spell, 20, 20 odd overs for, for less than 50 runs, I thought he bowled tremendously. Uh, so yeah, I have to give credit to him. Is there, is there a chance that you have actually got a good run here? Because you've just gone through quite a bit in the last second here. Yeah, I think, I think we've done okay so far. We had a good start, but as I said, we lost some crucial wickets during the end. But we can't really control that now. But I think that's a good score. As you said, the wicket has been blowing um, a bit. Coming on to the end there, so so I don't want to see how, how the other days play. See that Hetmeyer can hit a long ball. Can he still do some damage first thing in the morning? And yeah, he, he got a heavy um, IPL contract and he's showing it, showing why he got one. So hopefully tomorrow he could um, come and take up the mantle with the um, tail enders and see if he can push on to get a, a, a good enough score here in the first inning. What do you expect that wicket to do? Do you expect it to get a bit quicker or even break up? Yeah, well, um, first day is always a slow wicket at Kelton Oval, cricking up, cricking up on um, the two and three, and four and five is very unpredictable. So I can't say if it'll bounce, if it'll keep low, not sure. You've the, you've the probability that uh, the, you may be bowling laps. Um, do you think you've got enough spin options coverage? Uh, well, I think it, with the variable, if the variable bounce come in, comes into play, I think it'll be harder to to back fast bowling than spin because if the ball keeps going it'll be harder to adjust to the, to the quicker bowling so I can't really talk about that so you just have to work with what we have.